Kokori-san is the most famous scary game in Japan. It is similar to the Ouija board, and is mostly played by Japanese school children who want to summon a spirit so they can ask questions about the future. Kokori-san is Japan's answer to the Ouija board, and it has been played in school rooms across the country for years. The game became so widespread in Japan that it sparked several hysterias in the media, and many schools officially banned students from playing Kokori-san. Using a Ouija board can be dangerous, because it can accidentally summon demons or open people up to the possibility of being possessed. Kokori-san is much less dangerous, since the spirit who is summoned is a trickster spirit from the Shinto religion. Kokori-san is the name of the spirit who is summoned during the game, and provides the answers. It is an animal spirit that is a mixture between a fox, a dog, and a raccoon. Kok, meaning Kitsune, or fox, Ku, or Inu, dog, and Ri, as in Tanuki, a raccoon. The fox can be either a trickster or a teacher. The dog is loyal and protecting, and the raccoon is full of mischief, but also a bringer of good luck. All of these qualities are combined in Kokuri-san. Young people ask many questions like, Kokuri-san, who loves me? Or, Kokuri-san, will I become rich and famous? But just remember that there are some questions you are better off not knowing the answer to. To play Kokuri-san, you need at least two people, a sheet of paper, a pen, and a coin. Take a blank sheet of paper and draw a tori, a traditional Japanese gate, at the top in red ink. Write yes and no on either side of the tori. Beneath it, write one row of numbers from zero to nine and three rows of letters from A to Z. Two, open a window or door so that Kokuri-san will be able to enter the room. A tori presents the gateway to a Shinto shrine, and the spirit will enter and exit through it. Place a coin on the red tori. Each person should put their index finger on the coin. Call the spirit by saying, Kokuri-san, Kokuri-san, if you are here, please move this coin. You can ask Kokuri-san whatever questions you like. It will move the coin to spell out the answer. To end the game, you must ask Kokuri-san to leave by saying, Kokuri-san, Kokuri-san, please return home. The coin will move to yes, and then come to a rest on the red tori. When you are certain Kokuri-san has left, you must destroy the paper, either tear it to pieces or burn it. You must also spend the coin that you used before the end of the next day. Be warned, Kokuri-san is not dangerous, and it is a much safer alternative to the Ouija board, however, we still don't recommend that you play it. Many people can become upset and depressed if they receive answers that they do not like. Also, always remember, Kokuri-san is a trickster spirit and can easily lie to you. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the new scary series of scary games and rituals, which you can also call them paranormal games. Um, so now that you heard the story of what we are going to play, well, I have myself a chart of Kakuda-san right here that I got off of the internet. You just type it in and you'll get this. So I got my quarter too. I don't have a penny. Canada has no more pennies. So now I'm putting these rocks, these crystals in each corner because of the pages twirling upwards <laughs> and i am also going to open up microphonics and we'll start it 
in just a second. So you should be able to see. Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. So we're going to start this and see what happens. Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Can you come and play? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, can you come and play? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, can you come and answer my questions? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Can you come and answer my questions? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. I'm just listening, see. If, okay. Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Does someone love me? <laughs> Kakuda san. Kakuda san, am I going to be rich? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, am I going to be rich? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, am I going to be a big YouTuber? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Am I it won't let me talk. Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Am I going to be a famous YouTuber? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Am I going to die old? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Am I going to die soon? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Am I going to die soon? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Are you here with me right now? Kakuda-san, Kakuda-san, are you here with me to play? Kakuda-san, Kakuda-san, are you here? So, I don't know. One more question, guys, and we might as well stop. Okay. Kakuda san, Kakuda san, is this a real game? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, is this a real game? Kakuda san, Kakuda san. Is this just a legend? Kakuda san, Kakuda san, is this game just a legend? Okay, Kakuda san, it is now time to say goodbye. Kakuda san, Kakuda san, goodbye. Kakuda san, Kakuda san, goodbye. Kakuda san, you must go back to where you were. You are not allowed to attach yourself to me, my equipment, or anyone in this home. You must go back to where you were. Thank you and see you. That's what I heard. So guys, I guess this did not work like we planned out. 
it would. So, I don't know. Kakuda san. It says to destroy it after, rip it up into pieces. So that's what I've been doing right now as I'm talking to you. So I don't think this game works. But just on the safe side, guys, don't play this game at home. Just in case you're, when you decide to do it, you're more vulnerable than others. And it's a big, uh, there's like the veil is really thin that day and anything can come by. So just in case, don't play this game. Like they say, the Japanese consider it very dangerous. And uh, the Japanese you know, high schoolers are not even allowed to play that in their school. They get uh, kicked out of school and everything. So why? I don't know. They have more proof than we will ever have proof of Kakuda-san. If it w really works or what, I guess you have to go at it for weeks on end to get results of something or a lot of people get together and do it or just one person that doesn't work. So, well, at least I gave it a try for you guys. I always try these games out for you guys. And like I always say, Please do not do this at home uh, in case something happens. You never know what could happen. And on that note, I love you all very much. And thank you all for watching. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing for more videos like this. And I'll see you around the broom somewhere. Mm.